Tar Warney, 200 Longfellow. Um, ironically, neither Fox nor Burton suggest that the excessive calls for service be addressed using the one method proven to decrease calls for service, community-oriented policing. Instead, they suggest increasing officers. Fox and Burton also argue that calls for service are the reason we need to increase officers. According to Burton, 70 more officers are needed based on a per capita measure for the city. Sergeant Fox, on the other hand, utilizes a formula on the calls for service and says we need 52 more officers. <clears throat> Why don't they suggest the use of the only proven method for reducing calls for service? Two, Fox showed a video of the community outreach unit in his meetings with the community, highlighting the value of the community outreach unit, connecting families in need with social services, such as the food bank. But Fox and Burton do not suggest increasing access to social services. If part of the effectiveness of com community-oriented policing is getting social services to people in need, why is this not part of our overall plan for public safety? Three, Burton attributes, attributes excuse me, the community outreach unit's success in decreasing calls to the practice of COU officers giving their cell phone numbers to the community who would then call them with questions and concerns that would often prevent an actual call for service. But Fox and Burton do not recommend this as a practice that could be used by more officers. Thank you. Thank you.